In 2018, for our annual father-son trip, we went to the middle of nowhere, Missouri, in November. It was actually so cold that we got the first snow of the season. And it was desolate, which made the trip away from society even more enjoyable. And it might sound like a strange place to go, but there is actually an incredible national park there. It's called the Ozark National Scenic Riverways, and it's the first national park area specifically set aside to protect a river system. And it goes on for over 100 miles. There are multiple rivers involved, and what makes the riverways so special is that there are several natural springs that contribute to incredibly clear waters. We did a lot of exploring around the various historical sites. We did a lot of fishing, and we canoed the current river. This video is focused on that canoe trip, the beautiful scenery we got to take in, and the misfortune that took place that day. All right, we're at a canoe rental. We're gonna rent that canoe. And we're gonna go down that river. It's, um, it's 37 degrees out right now. So really do not want to flip the canoe. So really hoping that he doesn't screw that up for us. Oh, nice little pee. I'll show you how beautiful this river is here. I'm gonna flip the camera around. You can see just how pretty it is. We just missed the colors. There's still quite a few that have colors. We're getting ready to go. little break in order to have some lunch and because Shiner had to pee he kept whining Sit. Here, right in the middle. Perfect, Shiner. Perfect. Good dog. Son! Okay, we made landing one more time. We're on an island. Shiner. Shiner. Wild horses. Okay, 
Come in. Okay. Come on. Come on, one more. I heard, didn't I? Yeah. No, no. One that more. Way. Come on. Come on. Atta boy. Good job. <laughs> he gingerly that's stepped over the last one. He knows that's his spot. Sit now. Good dog. Here. He looks. Lean your back against the crossbar. Stay to the left of the... I think we need to follow the V and then cut left under the tree. Oh, we can't. What can we? There's a log there. You sure? No, I'm not sure, but it looks like something's there. Don't you see that? I see foam there. I think we go straight underneath the log. Okay. I mean, I don't... No, let's use foam. Okay, left. Left. And just like that, we were in those pristine spring-fed waters on a 37-degree day in the middle of November. In addition to there being debris in the water, there was also a bend in the river at this point, and Shiner took off to the other side of the river. Almost instinctively, my dad started wading back across the river, and I was not able to get the camera rolling until he had already grabbed Shiner. You're going deeper than you did the first time over. Hey, he can, yeah, just put him in there, he'll come. He's sweet, he can swim. Shiner, come on. Come on, buddy. Come on. Shiner, come on. Come on. Good dog. Good dog. Dad, you should get out of that water. So, we flipped, there happened to be a tree down, and apparently that tree hit my dad, knocked him sideways, and after that we were, we were in. So, good news is, we came somewhat prepared for this. We have new clothes, with the exception of with the exception of shoes. So we're just gonna have some wet feet going back. Coming down here, coming down here. We we're trying to figure out what to do right around here. Finally decided we we're gonna go through the foam and 
apparently in doing so when we were going through there is kept pushing us out, right? Because that, that's where all the water goes is out that way. And somewhere in there, it must have been that tree actually, right there, that got my dad. And then we flipped. I don't remember exactly what happened other than I remember going over, I remember staring at the GoPro. And I was staring at the tackle box and I was staring at all the stuff that wasn't attached and couldn't could float away. And I remember looking and seeing the canoe not be not completely flip over, right? It kind of was listed sideways. That's when I grabbed it and kind of pushed up on it. And I was swimming at that point, but about 30 seconds later I could walk. And I brought the canoe over here. And Shiner ran to the other bank. My dad ended up down here, so he went across and got Shiner. And now I better wipe him off. Okay, we're about to set off again. We should be pretty close to our destination though. And uh, yeah, really wet feet. Yeah, not a lot of clothes on, yeah. Well, we finally made it out, made it back to the car. Now it's time to get warm. It's really cold. We woke up and all the water was frozen and uh, my dad has a thermometer on his watch which is not the best thermometer but it read 28 degrees in the tent today this morning. So it was cold. It was a cold night. Clothing rack there is from all of our wet clothes from dumping in the river yesterday when we were canoeing and uh, they're all solid stiff. <laughs> 